All right, guys. So now we are going to talk about our martial arts schools considered to gyms. Well, yes. <laughs> yes, because what is a gym? A gym is a place where you go and train your body or make some cardio. Yeah, train your body in general, okay? So martial arts schools are, are gyms because you train your body there, you know? It's, it's kind of obviously if you think in that way, okay? Because uh, I've been in like uh, three or four martial arts schools in my whole life. And I remember one that that had all this uh, had this uh, I don't know if if I say it correctly in English but had this uh, tatami uh, where do you train the the martial arts and and had this uh, gym machine machines too you know where when you make uh, when you lift weights or or do some push ups and all the stuff so yes martial arts schools are considered uh, gyms. And if you think about that, um, there are some martial arts schools that have all these machines about gyms, and there are ones that doesn't. It only has, you know, these punching bags and and the gloves and the rings and and that's all. But yes, technically or literally, yeah, there there are there are considered gyms. And it helps. It also has in common that you have to pay regularly for a month, uh, and it gives you a schedule to follow for your classes. And well, that's that's the big difference uh, now. I think the big difference between a, a martial arts school and in a gym. I stand in a gym uh, almost always. You can go anytime you want. You know, you can go, let's say, from 9 in the morning to 11 o'clock or for, from 5 to 7 uh, in the afternoon. But usually in martial arts schools, uh, they give you a schedule. They say, no, uh, it will be open from 11 to 1 or for, from 5 to 7 o'clock. So you have to be there in that time. And yes, it's that's that's usually what almost happens unless you are in a really big gym, in a really big gym. Because I know I never been in one of those, but I know there are uh, a couple of gyms in here in my country that you can go, that you can go, you can go everywhere, uh, any anytime, anytime, because they have a lot of um, of martial arts teachers. Or there is always the same, but it's it makes it uh, it keeps uh, training the people, you know. Uh, do you ever hear about the the yokao, the yokao in, in Thailand? Well, that's uh, that's uh, the best gym uh, in in Muay Thai in the whole world. The best gym of Muay Thai in the whole world. And what is Muay Thai? Muay Thai. Muay Thai is is. Uh, it's a martial art that it goes when you are. Um, uh, how do you say? It? Uh, it's a combat, a combat sport uh, that you make uh, stand, stand up. Okay, you know what I mean? Because there are two types of martial arts. Uh, there is the martial arts when you are laying on, on the ground, uh, usually like uh, jiu jitsu, uh, brasileiro, and stuff. But um, the um, the Muay Thai is one of when you're up and for me and for almost everyone who know about uh, martial arts uh, that's the best martial art uh, in stand-up you can do you know and yet that's a gym that is almost always is almost always open to the people uh, I don't know if there is only one teacher or maybe I'm not but um, I think there is three or four of them, I don't know. This is the best gym in the whole world. So, but yeah, answer, answering, uh, answering the public, the public, answering the, the question, yes, martial arts schools are considered gyms.